The axe versus the sword. Yeah, this is a pretty cool topic. We're going to be talking about these two. Kind of going over the differences so you know what the axe and the sword are about. So let's go ahead and get out just like an iron axe and an iron sword. Okay, so they're pretty cool stuff, right? Yeah, yeah. Well, uh, so the first thing you might be asking is which one's better. Of course, the real answer is it depends on what you're wanting them for. In most cases, when you're going out fighting and killing a bunch of different things, most often you'll probably prefer the sword. A lot of that is because of the enchantments you can put on it and the quick recharge. Much faster than the axe. However, there is a benefit of the axe. One, it always has 9 attack damage. In fact, this is where I actually prefer stone axes. Because, you know, cobblestone is cheap, right? See, still 9 attack damage. Oh, except for the netherite. That's a little bit different. But, I mean, that's still a lot of damage. 10 attack damage for a netherite axe. But, yeah. But the thing is, when you hit, watch how slowly, underneath my crosshairs, watch how slowly that recharges. First, the sword. See? Sword is much faster. But this sword only does 6 damage. So, where an axe is the most effective is when you use it for a critical hit. That's when you jump up, and as you you're falling you hit something a critical hit occurs when you hit something while you're falling so let's go up to a creeper and just fall you know do a critical hit that one I already hurt let's do one I haven't hurt one two see with the stone axe if you use a critical hit it kills almost anything in just two hits and two critical hits See that, that if you that's where it's useful it's also really useful against creepers that might be chasing you so let's get myself some armor. Just not in the habit of dying right now. That's good enough. Game mode, survival. Okay, creeper, you're going to chase me. And you run and hit once. And then you do your critical hit. Dead. You see that? Axes are very useful when it comes to killing creepers. I love them. Ah, stone axe, that's where it's useful. But of course the sword, you know, is much quicker. So if you're hitting something more frequently, where's, I need like a zombie or something. Ah. Okay, let's put some zombies down. So that's like a horde right here. See, if you have to hit a lot of them fast, sword every time. But the thing is, a sword, if you enchant it, you can get it to be pretty much the same as an axe, but still hitting fast. But the sword gets extra special enchantments that in survival without cheating you can't really do, such as smite. You know, you can't put that on an axe. Sm uh, an axe can get sharpness, I, I believe, is that right? I think I remember that. But, yeah, you, you, you want... So let's let's go ahead and put down an anvil and put sharpness on the sword and then see how much damage it does. Okay. That's just an iron sword, right? Nine attack damage. Okay, so now it does the exact same as an axe, but it's fast hitting. So you know that, that makes it much better than the axe, as long as you put the enchantments on it. But the axe is cheap. If you need quick, just I mean just cheap high damage, axe is where you go. But if you have the technology and you can upgrade to it, then the sword, in the end, is definitely going to be better than the axe. So, you know, that's kind of the differences there when you're working with them. Uh, also, if it's a situation where you only have a chance for one swipe at something, and then you have to back off like a creeper, or suppose it's like the ender dragon, maybe you can only get up to it once, you know, an axe might be a better bet. So, you know, something you, you can't hit very often. I, I think axes are most useful against creepers. Um, yeah, so those are the kind of differences. I mean, obviously an axe, if you t choose your axe to be your weapon, then you can just carry inventory and use it for both harvesting wood and attack. So that's kind of nice. There's a little bit more efficiency there when doing that. Um, but the other thing, too, and this is a problem, when you use an axe for attack, it loses its durability faster than a sword. Now, if just for a moment, it seems like, remember, they changed it so the axe worked the same as a sword, and then it looks like they changed it back. I'm hoping... 
They'll go back again and let us use an axe like a sword. Or maybe, like, if you put, like, sharpness on an axe, then it helps the durability or something. That, that's important. If, if you're using an axe as your main weapon, and suppose you do enchant it up and stuff, I highly suggest you get mending, because otherwise it's just going to break faster than a sword will. So that, that's something important. But, of course, if you're enchanting a weapon up, you can probably just... You know, if you're already going to put that expensive stuff into it, you might as well just keep the sword instead. Now we're going to end with one last thing. We're going to look at an axe that has sharpness on it. Should we do the netherite? 13 attack damage. Look at that. So a sharpness axe, of course, is going to be absolutely epic. Where's where's my zombies? Wow! Let's put some more zombies in. And just kill everything quick. Isn't that cool? Yeah, sharpness on an axe does do a lot of damage. And of course, the higher the ore, you know, like netherite's the highest, the quicker it recharges. So a, an iron axe recharges faster than a stone axe. So you might prefer that as well. Okay, well, there's just some little things right there about the axe versus the sword. You know, in my opinion, it's all about situation as far as what is better. But in the long run, um, I would most of the time I still choose sword over axe for fighting. You know, pretty cool. Okay, well, that's all for this video. But if you have questions, you know, comment section below. Good place to ask questions. That's all.